Hey guys, so I'm here to give you a full body conditioning workout. All you need is one dumbbell, so just one piece of equipment. And then if you have a couch or a table, um, you can also utilize that for some jumps. Otherwise, we're going to do some jumping on the floor. Um, so I'm going to run you through, we're going to do five different exercises. We're going to do 10 reps of each on each side, um, if a side is warranted. Um, and then we're going to run through that four, maybe five times. Um, and that will work out. So um, we're going to start with the dumbbell snatch. So this one's a little bit harder. Um, so with our dumbbell snatch, I will give you an alternative. So the first one we're going to do, start strong core down into a semi squat position. We're going to toss the dumbbell up and catch it overhead, bring it back down. So we're going to string together 10 of those on each side. Now, if that's too hard, the other option we can do is a pull to press is the other variation. Either one is fine, but I prefer the dumbbell snatch if you can. So 10 on each side for those. Then you're going to go into 10 box jumps or couch jumps, you might say, um, or just 10 jumps on the spot. So if you have a couch, we can do 10 jumps onto the couch and step off. If you have no couch or no table, 10 body weight jump squats. So sinking down to the squat, nice soft landing. 10 of those. Then the third exercise we're going to go into is a split jerk with one dumbbell. So we're going to hold it on one side. Strong core. We're going to hop and lunge at the same time. So hop, stick it in the lunge. So hop, press, land in that lunge. So 10 on each side. Then you're going to go into 10 burpees because what's conditioning without burpees? So we can do a full burpee, chest to the floor. So hands come down all over the floor, hop in and up, or if we need to modify, hands down, hop out, hop in, hop up to the top. And then our last exercise is the single arm dumbbell thruster. So we're going to start nice and strong in the core, full squat, to press. Ten on each side. After you complete one round of ten reps of all of those, you're going to take about 30 to 60 seconds of rest, then cycle through that four, maybe five times. I'm hoping anywhere from like 15, 20 to 25 pounds, if accessible. If not, you can do anything from 10 to 12 as well. So, I'm out of breath, I'm just doing. Um, but yeah, let me know how it goes, guys. Tag me the workout. I posted this in my story the other day and everyone seemed to like it. So, hopefully it's a good one.